They made an edition of the All Africa Music Awards Afrima is around the corner. Today in Lagos, the organizers of the award ceremony held a media briefing to unveil the African artists that will be rewarded for their contribution to the growth of the highly lucrative music industry in Africa. TV Tracy's Telma Okoro was there and our report. In October, we all met at the Four Points Sheraton to announce Nigeria. After a week-long period of screening the flood of entries submitted for the 2014 All African Music Awards, AFRIMA, the International Committee unveiled the highly anticipated nominees list for the awards at this press conference. Emerging from a rigorous period of collating, screening, grading, and auditing the flood of quality entries that were submitted Nominees were drawn from a total of 26 countries across the continent. For the 2014 edition, the award project received a staggering total of 2,025 works submitted by African music industry artists, professionals and journalists for just 32 categories. Members of the public will ultimately decide who wins what awards. Yes, there are two levels of um, voting that uh, AFRIMA has adopted. The first level is uh, that that the jury comprising of um, the academy and uh, the member of the jury will vote on. And the other is um, the category that the public will vote on. So which eventually means that um, for most of the categories that will be unveiled today, um, the public have a 50% voting power uh, on all of those categories. Visibly noticeable on the nominees list are Nigerian artists who dominate the category for Best Male Artist in West Africa and Best Female Artist in West Africa. Ghana Sakudi featuring Castro. And the title of this song that they have been nominated is Adonai. Next is DJ Harafat from Côte d'Ivoire for the song Binchin Pinting. The next four nominees are from Nigeria. Dari for Special Fever, Davido for Skelewu, Flavor for Adada, and Two Face Idibia for Dance in the Rain. The best female artists from West Africa, six as usual, from Benin, Benin Republic, Anjali Kijo for Shangoa. The rest are from Nigeria, interestingly. Apparently overwhelmed by the number of entries received, the organizers say the process of selecting the nominees for the AFRIMA Awards wasn't an easy task. It was 19 to 20 hour days, literally, of deliberations, discussions, debates around the best uh, and not so the best uh, entries. So it was a very difficult process, especially because uh, the, the jury was made up of 13 very experienced music uh, specialists uh, that were represented, um, that represented the five key regions of Africa and also some that represented the diaspora in the UK and the US. Nigeria may have witnessed its own fair share of award ceremonies in the past, but the organizers say this particular award ceremony is one with a difference. What makes Afrima different is about the vision, the mission and direction of Afrima and the objectives. And don't forget Afrima is an award ceremony, a project from within, not from without. It's a project that's telling the story and the narrative of Africa. We're telling our own story from our own perspectives. You understand? And what we call it differentiates is that we're in partner with the African Union using a net, that huge network to use it to achieve the objective of integration, prosperous and peaceful Africa. We want to use the instrumental music to integrate and unite our people, to know more about Africa, our land, our people. Everything you've had before now is an African award by those in the diaspora. And this is what we're doing for ourselves. As you can see, everybody on this high table today is and completely African. Artists from 84 countries and five regions will vie for the 32 categories at the All African Music Awards, which will reward outstanding artists for their excellence and immense contribution to African music at the main award ceremony slated to hold November 9, 2014 in Lagos, Nigeria. Thelma Okoro, TV360, Lagos.